Hello, everybody. Welcome to Stain Tupperware. That's Eric. Hi. You're not going to say that's Eli? God damn it, Eric. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Eli. Guess I'm on my own here. Holy shit, I forgot about the unbearable heat. Uh, we're, <laughs> we're in the desert. Just chilling. Like a villain, I would I would like to add. Uh, what like, do you think, Eric? Three minutes or five minutes or four minutes or t ten and a half minutes? Um, maybe the f five minutes, I think. You want to use the five minute one? All right. Chili steam shrooms. I oh, didn't make the noise. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Let's, uh, what's up with this guy? Oh, he's a painter. It's paintbrush hair. Oh, he's got paintbrush hair! It's awesome. You know what? People need to step up their hair game. This is creative as fuck. <laughs> if I saw a painter with hair like this, I'd be like, y you know what's up. This gets more fascinating the more I look at it. It seems the shape holds some special meaning. Hmm? Ah. Oh. I was so engrossed in my work that I didn't realize I had a fellow traveler to converse with. In case you couldn't tell, I'm a... P I, I, oh, shit. I thought that said I'm a partner. I'm a painter. I travel the world <laughs> in search of beautiful sights. The mysterious floating islands are only the most recent to catch my eye. I was just painting that small island there, as a matter of fact. Where? Oh, that one. Really far huh. away. Granted, you can't see it very well when the clouds are in the way. Ever since the upheaval, the sky's been filled with floating islands. But none has caught my fancy so much as that exquisitely shaped one there. I can't quite explain it, but it feels as though it's speaking to me somehow. Hmm. It says, dye your hair. <laughs> Why are the floating islands up there? It can't hurt to take a little time out of your day to stop and think about it. All right, Picango, you're one of my new favorite people. Goodbye. All right, uh, we're on a mission. Yeah. We're going to. We're going to. I think this is it right here, Gerudo City. Click. What symbol should we go for? The skull. Yeah. Oh crap! What direction is that in? Does the yeah, skunk kind of really not direction. mark it on your mini map? It's too far away. I think it does if it's close enough. If you want it marked on your mini map, you gotta use one of those. See the red thing? One of those. Uh huh. Maybe I should have used one of those. Can I pause right now? Pause. Um. Delete stamp. Here, I put a purple one. Yeah, a purple. That's where we're going. Oh, hey, look, another uh, glyph on the land. Where? Oh, shit. What is it? I have no idea. I can't quite make out what it. Oh, is that supposed to be Ganon? Oh, yeah, maybe. See, I see a nose and a beard. He's got a big old honker and a beard. That's a really big feed if that is the case. You know what that means. Do you? Yes. You ever heard that? Yes. Apparently if you got big feet, you got a big dong. <laughs> it's probably not even close to true, but... <laughs> People say it, so it must be true. Alright, I'm gonna stop here and get some stamina back. Pick this up for no reason. I'm gonna throw it off this cliff, because that's what I would do in real life if I saw a rock in a cliff. <laughs> I'm a simple man. What can I say? Right? Satisfying. Ah, despawned. Alright, um... Can I see from here? I can see the beacon. Hmm. What do you think that thing is? What do you think it is? Tell me. I'm going to guess your it's guess. a watchtower for, I don't know, those lizard folk or whatever. We're going to find out. That's what it is. Hey, look, there's some dinguses down there. 
Spit on them. <laughs> Even better. I gotta take a leak. <laughs> <laughs> we need more stamina. I feel like I don't have enough. Oh, speaking of that, there's a shrine. Guess where we're going. Man, what am I looking at? Oh, it's an oasis. A desert penis. Holy fuck. <laughs> so caught up thinking about it. How come every time I take my heat resistance shit, the temperature goes back down? Yeah, that's a really good question. Or I don't it, understand the desert. But it displays it as lower because you've got heat resistance. I don't think it does. I mean, maybe it does. Is that a so. bird person? Bird person, no! <laughs> Eric, please tell me you've at least seen that iconic Rick and Morty moment. Uh, Eric hasn't watched Rick and Morty. Just doesn't jive with my sense of humor. I don't know how the show's gonna move forward without Justin Roiland. Remember we were having this conversation before, a while back, in a different episode? Yeah. Uh, it turns out that, uh, he, like, his charges were all dismissed or whatever. Hmm. Yeah, his wife was just trying to take him through the ringer. Or his ex-wife, I suppose, now. So, yeah. That's why I was saying, like, it's unfortunate that he got fired immediately. Like, you know, I, I don't, I'm not saying that, like, no repercussions should come necessarily, but I am saying, like, it's unfortunate that he lost his job. Do I have to rewind in here? I think so. It's unfortunate that he lost his, oh, okay, I can stand on this. I thought I was going to slide down with him. It's unfortunate he lost his job, you know, because his wife wanted to spread some shit that might not have necessarily been true. Wow, fuck, this is harder than it looks. <laughs> Here's hoping it's not hot in here. Ready? Start! I wonder if I needed that. Hey. Just sits there. <laughs> so. We are very close to the thing. What thing? Um. The uh, Garuda village. Oh, yeah. It's not that far out. Then we can get our heat resistance armor and get back on our secret mission. Oh, I see what you're supposed to do. You gotta build a boat. A swamp boat. Is it a swamp? It's, it's sand. It's sand that behaves only like video game sand ever could. Because you'll never see sand that behaves like this in real life. Except for in that one video on YouTube where Buddy like pumped the air through the sand. You see that? I actually haven't. It turns to liquid like this. Like you can swim in it. Huh. If you pump air through sand. Yeah. It's kind of neat. Kind of weird. Turn this. Glue that. Stop. And two. A control stick so we can actually choose the direction we're going. You know, I thought these controls were really clunky when I first started playing this game. And maybe they are still a little, but I'm getting a lot more used to them. Ah, I knew the sand would push it back. <laughs> Alright, what else is in this room? You know that it's not the only thing. I'm not going right to the shrine. There's stuff over here. Lots of stuff. Look at this. Crazy Fan stuff. boat's fucking working out. I like this. Right? Ah, remember where we parked, Eric? Okay, I hope it stays we'll do. there. Looks like it is. Hold on. My gamer instinct told me to look over there. 
<laughs> I don't even know if there is like hidden stuff in this game, but I look anyway. It's always important to check. Sick, ten arrows. I'll always take arrows, man. I love using those things. Range is everything in this game, I've learned. If you need, if you need, uh, if you need to get up close, you're really risking it for your biscuit. Come on, Link. Ah, fuck's sake. Link, you took too long. <laughs> there we go. Oh. You don't have a battery gauge right now. Oh, that's weird. Uh, yeah, I didn't notice that until you pointed it out. Wonder if it's just oh, like a limited power. Yeah, <laughs> in this temple maybe. Oh man, doesn't take me long to bust out a Star Wars quote. Na 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 na. -na. Visitor to the Shrine of Light, which purifies evil and stuff. <laughs> Light of Blessing. Ooh, we got nine. So, I looked it up between episodes here, just because, like, you know, I want to start getting more health and stamina. So it's like four, I guess, is the cost. And you gotta go to, like, a statue to pray to do the thing. I don't know if it gives you a choice. Like, if it lets you decide... If you want stamina or health, or if it's just like, no, you're fucking taking whatever you get. Like, like if it's random. Yeah, I'm kind of curious, Ooh, too. Ooh, Karakara Bazaara. <sighs> All this stuff is fresh. I would hope so. Some steak. Some, some tail. Fuse it with a weapon. Add lashing whip-like quality attacks. Huh. You know what? I can afford hey. one. I'm gonna buy one. Ah. Make a sword whip? Yeah, I just want to see what, what it's about. I'm good on food, though. Thank hey. you. If the heat bothers you... Is there more to that? <laughs> uh, the latest fashion crazes straight from Gerudo Town. Oh, this is one of the things I need. Oh! <laughs> Sweet, I'm glad I stopped here. Perfect. Um... Uh, Wait, and even if you already got one, why did you settle for one when you could get one in a different color? <laughs> a big thing when you... Uh, okay. If you're interested in a store, blah, 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 die shop, tourist hotspot. Okay, oh. so I can die stuff. That's neat. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what? I'm not trying to sell stuff. I want your headband. Fucking, just let me buy it. Oh, I have to go over here. Oh. That's it. I know, very fashionable. Give me it. <laughs> oh my god. Why does everyone talk so much in this game? <laughs> just like It should have just been like, you want to buy that? Very nice. Thank you, have a nice day. Like, I don't yeah. need your fucking life story. I feel like I'm looking up a recipe online. <laughs> Let me tell you my entire fucking backstory, and then I'll get to the ingredients. Jesus. People are nuts. It actually looks pretty cool. It does. Savak. Savak. Hmm, you're an unfamiliar face. Are you a member of the caravan squad heading to Gerudo? Yeah, I'm not interested in what you have to say, honestly. <laughs> I wish I could just do that in real life. I'm not. I can't be that rude though. Oil jar. Ooh, hydro melons. No, we got a, a lot of heat resistant stuff right now. We're good. And heck, with the uh, the headband there, that ought to help immensely. Then, then move to the sea. <laughs> she likes sea men. <laughs> uh. Ooh, a little fishing village. I never even thought that there would be an ocean somewhere. Now I want to see the ocean. Yeah. Ocean, though? <laughs> oh, I forgot about that video. All right, give me this. I like that you can just pick up treasure chests. Yeah, I don't want to go over there. Give me it. Gerudo bow. 
25 damage to... Oh. Okay, what is getting thrown out? I guess this one right here. That is a very powerful bow. Oops. Alright. I always... I'm the kind of guy that, like, I use my weak stuff first. So if yeah. I... Then I have the strong stuff if uh. I need it. Need some travel security. Do I buy the arrows? How many do I? I got 114. Ah. I'm not hurting for arrows. Whoa. The sand shroud? Dig dog bridge? Huh? Oh. oh, that's a recipe! Oh. That's kind of... I love that world building. Yeah. Spa. I don't care about your spa. But I love that world building of just like, hey, if you get all this stuff, you can make that. Yeah, that's that's one of the best things ever. Read the Zonai survey team's three big ideas. Surveying shrines, surveying chasms, our team's... No. Ugh, even the books are long-winded. <laughs> um... Excuse me, princess. We you be using the end? Regular bed is 20... Uh, no, thank you. That does remind me, though, it's getting late, and I have a lot less cold-resistant stuff than I do heat-resistant stuff. So uh, I think I'm going to sleep at the fire. Back. Fully stocked pouch is the best defense. Buy my stuff. Where's the end? Uh. Buy my stuff. Oh, I don't want to sell oh. shit to you. I thought you might buy her stuff. Mm. Go away. You guys all piss me off. <laughs> Oh, there's a fire. Have I been in that shrine? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, that was the one with the uh, sand boat. Can you go back through shrines? Like, how do you tell if you've completed it? I have no idea. I think it tells me on the map. Maybe not. Are you sure I've done this one? Uh-huh. I don't remember doing it. I have the memory of a goldfish, though. Oh! Okay. Yeah, you're right, because you gotta activate the door. I, th I hope I can just turn around and leave. Yeah, okay. Sorry, everybody. <laughs> it's all the herb of mist, Link. Fuck's sakes. It's all that herb of mist. <laughs> And also dehydration, because I'm in the desert. I drink that water, but then I get ringworm. Should we climb that? Probably. We could probably get some dist. If we can get to the top, we can get some distance. Yeah. Hey. Holy fuck, the temperature just climbed. Oh, it's because I got near that fire. Wow, this game is really, uh... How do I word it? Dynamic? Yeah, I think dynamic works. Beetle, you're here too? Fuck everybody's yeah. selling everything here. <laughs> Alright, what do you got, Beetle? Eh. It's always hard to tell if shopping with Beetle is a good deal or a rip-off. Yeah, I don't pay enough attention to prices, really. Up the thing we go, though. What happens if I run out of stamina on the ladder? Oh, I just have to climb it like a regular doofus. <laughs> I wish I could leap up ladders like that. I wonder if that's even possible. Well. Uh, come on, which side do I climb? <laughs> it's, it's not letting me. There we go. Come on. The good news uh, is at least it doesn't do the uh, Metal Gear Solid thing. What? If you run out of stamina on a ladder, you drop. Isn't there a Metal Gear game where there's like a fucking ladder that takes like a half hour to go up? Yeah, Metal Gear Solid 3. What a dick move. Uh-huh. And the entire time you have to listen to this like James Bond game style 
Or James Bond movie style song. <laughs> It'll be getting hot before too long. Hey, what are you? What are you? What a question is that? I'm a hillian, you dick. <laughs> Listen, this is the lighthouse for the bazaar. It's not for a tourist destination or a place to play around uh. on. That said, I guess it's fine now that you're already here. Go ahead and enjoy the view of the desert. After all, <laughs> hey, you little shit, you shouldn't be here. Whatever. <laughs> Do you care or not? Like, I don't understand what angle you're trying to work here. Okay, so we gotta go there. Oh, I can see the fucking... So if we can just keep our straight line through the sandstorm, we should be fine, right? Presumably. They mentioned something about it being a sand shroud. Oh, there's the shroud! <laughs> <laughs> that was sudden. Yeah, I'll say. Oh, and you got no map. This'll be... Yeah, that's why I said, well, you gotta go in a straight line. Go in a straight line. Also, you have very limited visibility, so... Good luck Desert Rift. Oh, fuck. I didn't expect to come across this. So much for my straight line. Was there right. something nearby you could climb to... Let's see if we got a Zoni device that might help. Oh, you know what? The spring would actually do it. Let's see if there's just anything else here that might do better. Nah, spring it is. Spring into action. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I got a glimpse over the... So we're still going in the right direction, too. Perfect. What is this? Something truly nutty. Oh, fuck, I got another spring here. Oh. And whatever that is. Well, you can use the spring. Oh, a rocket. Oh, you have a rocket shield, don't you? And a sled. I have multiple rocket shields. What the fuck is this thing? can't interact with it. Holy shit, why do I... Why did I just take damage? Uh, I... Heat higher than your resistance allows for? Did it go up? Yeah. Oh, I didn't notice. Alright. Let's get back on track. Link, can you please turn around? <sighs> Thank you. Look at that, we're almost there. Desert walruses? Okay, thank God they're friendly. Uh oh. Alright, gotta get my, uh. Eat something cold. Oh God, that, like, chewing animation was so fucking weird. Can we play that back? That's amazing. <laughs> Oh my god. That was. That actually kind of caused my back to like... Ah, shit. All... Ooh, what is that? Something not very nice. <laughs> well, there's only one of them. Hello. Do you bite? Oh god! What the fuck is this thing? I don't know, but it's spooky. Fire! Oh, dude! A gibdo bone? Creepy bone with multiple sharp tips. <laughs> Giggity. <laughs> Attach it to a weapon to greatly increase its attack power. It tends to break easily due to its odd shape. Neat. And a claymore. Oh, okay, uh... Oh yeah, that lizard tail Yeah, thing. where the fuck is that? Oh, I already have some. Shit, I wouldn't have spent that, like, 80 rupees. 
I can't drop it? Hold. Drop. That's weird. Normally I don't have to do that. Neat. Very neat. Okay, uh, I actually looked it up a little bit, and I think everyone's in a bunker down down in the basement. Everyone's everyone's hidden because of the sandstorm. Cool. Oh, that's okay. We'll get to it. Hey, message in a bottle. Do do do. Hey, what? What? I can't pick it up. You can't grab it. Oh no, you can. I was about to say. It's you at long last. You, the Vo Rita, reading this. Uh, uh, the Vo I wanted, I was fated to meet. What? What does Vo mean? I and have I'm the Vo no you idea. Were destined for. You must hurry and rescue me. I am locked away in the outside world. Do not worry, though. I will send all my love to you until you come and find me. Stay safe and know that we will meet soon. It is our destiny, after all. Caliban. Huh. Listen, Caliban, we just met. You're really clingy. <laughs> I don't think this is the right direction. Oh, there's another message in a bottle. Did my box thing break? Yeah. Oh. Beam emitter, Zonite Club. Shit, I don't think I have anything that can break rock. Ah, it could be a problem. Yeah, it could. <laughs> Do you at long last, uh... Is this the same thing? Yep. Fuck sakes, Caliban, how many did you throw in here? <laughs> Yeah, I can't. I don't have any weapons that can uh, not use my body. Oh, uh, hold on. I'll fuse the torch with the rock. There we go. I got something. Yay! What is the point of this? Uh. Oh, you can fall in there. Oh. In like Flint, that's my favorite movie. <laughs> oh, I watched Austin Powers the other day. Uh, I think it's the second one. I'm pretty sure it's the second one. There's a lot of rock here. No fucking kidding. Whoops. Is that really a dead end? Crap. I don't want to use all my bomb flowers like this. Oh, that's definitely going to kill me. Fire in the hole. Come on. Rusty Claymore. Now if you find a rock. I don't think I can fuse with these ones. Yeah. I want a rock! I want a rock! I want it! You want it! What was the point of this? There's nothing here. There's a route back down to that first area. And a rock down there, I think. I think there was more than one rock. Oh, oh it's rock salt. Ah, oh, shit, shit, shit. Alright. That seemed really pointless. There was yeah. nothing down there. Except for some rusty swords, which hey, at least means you got a, a hammer. Yeah, better than nothing, I suppose. The guide said go against the water. 
to get where we're supposed to be going, but I wanted to see what's this way. I'm an explorer. I can't help myself. I hope I don't drown. Oh, okay. Thank God I can walk. This is a fascinating area. It's bigger than I thought. That's what she said. Oh. Oh, this is just to get one of those golden turd guys. I bet. I don't know. Should we come up there? We could try. We came all this way. We might as well. Swim Fucking Korok dicks. <laughs> Swim to the surface. Through the ground. Uh... That was not what I was expecting. Be gone, Korok. I really wish I could kick these things. Like, you have <laughs> no idea how much I wish I could... Maybe I can. <sighs> not satisfying enough. Can I pick them up? Uh, only certain ones you can pick up. I think you can only pick up the ones with the backpacks. Yeah. And... I've seen people do horrid things to those backpack-wearing ones. We will be one of those people. I swear to God, before this, uh, before this playthrough on Tears of the Kingdom is over, you and I will be sending one of those things to the moon. I honestly can't wait. Do 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 do. -do. Is that another bottle? Yeah, I don't know if they're all from the same lady. I'm going to assume they are. Ah, oh, it is. Whatever. Why not, uh... Whoops. All right, here we go. Hopefully this brings me somewhere good. There we go. This is where everyone is. Oh, what? What's happening? Eric, you read this. A vo. There's a vo here. Stop him. Is that a racial slur? Better not be. Yeah, I'm kind of... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. <clears throat> Vo are not. Oh, you, that's still you. Vo are not permitted to be here. You must leave at once. What? Why? Oh. Oh yes, somebody stick it up for me. Hello. Bo Bulgaria. Bulgaria. <laughs> it has been some time, swordsman. It is all right. This one has the chief's permission to enter, and he is welcome to visit any of the shops and businesses. Spread the word. Let everyone know this is the case. Oh. For you to have come all this way, enduring the strange storm that plagues us, you must have some important news to share. No, I just need some heat resistance armor. Mm -hmm. The princess of Hyrule is still missing. We had heard of the events at Hyrule Castle, but these are... The, but things are dire, indeed. Still, swordsman, I mean Link, I am impressed you made it here through the storm that surrounds Gerudo Town. Mm. The sand shroud settled, upon, uh, settled on us some time ago. We sent out patrols to try and determine what was causing it, but a swarm of monsters, creatures called Gibdo, suddenly appeared, attacked our troops, and forced us to retreat. The Gibdos have even made their way into town. As a result... Everyone was evacuated to the shelter for safety. As someone charged with protecting Gerudo, Gerudo Town... <laughs> my fucking mouth didn't want to say that. I am ashamed at our current situation. This is all to say that, although I wish I could help you search for the princess, now is not a good time. I am sorry. Mm. Lady Riju is currently training. She is trying to become strong enough to save us from this disaster. If you are hoping to speak with Lady Riju, you should visit the ruins to the north. Well then. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, nope. 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 Who the fuck are you? Get away from me. So Children many little kids. 
Goddamn children. Oh, this is one of those things we were looking for. Oh. Like. Yeah. Give me the stamina. Where the hell? You who have conquered the shrines and claimed the light of blessing. All right. Oh, we do get to pick. Cool. All right. We're going to go one health and one stamina. Yeah, that makes sense. Da -da -da -da. Ugh, that's weird. Yeah. Oh, it's even weirder that it uses, like, the red stuff. I've typically associated that with Ganon and evil. Uh-huh. I wonder if there's some hidden lore there. Yeah, right, maybe. Give me some stamina. What does the stamina vessel look like? Oh, that's weird. Uh-huh. I mean, I can kind of dig it. Yeah. I didn't mean weird in a bad way. Just not what I was expecting. Yay! Oh, we get like a little bit of an extra... Okay, I wasn't sure how that would work either. Very nice. Alright, we're looking for armor dealers. So let me just have a quick peek around. Hey. Welcome. Wait, a man. Is that a problem? Uh, the Garuda are an all-female race. Oh, I didn't with know With one exception. Wow, this one's thick as a dump truck. <laughs> Damn! The only male Garuda is Ganon. Oh, these are his people. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Well then, I can't find who I'm looking for. Can I just pick these up? I can just take these. Thank you. <laughs> Am I a hero? <laughs> robbing from these poor people who are stuck in this bunker. What is this? What are you? This is the jail. Ah. Uh, wait. How do I break rules? How do I... Oh. I'm going to look that up between episodes. <laughs> None of you guys. None of you guys. All right. You know what, everyone? We'll see you guys next time on Stain Tupperware. I'll find the armor person. Yeah, laters.